Like, I'm not gonna lie to the fans. Every time I see a cop or pass a cop or I'm driving behind a cop like there's one right up there, I'm tripping, dude. Like, I'm, I'm pretty bad bugged out right now, to be honest. Like, Tamale, baby. Hey, always been a black sheep, struggling to work the ATM. I just bit 20k on black at the Good morning, YouTube. It's 421 in the morning. I missed 420 by one minute. I got a, a list of stuff here. Camera stuff, camera, bong, blankets, pillow, clean inside truck and mattress. Then we're gonna hit the road. Good morning. Out here loading my covers. If it's this cold out there, sleeping in the back of here is gonna be no joke. So I got my covers going in now, and my pillows. Rig's looking dialed. Drives pretty good. I drove to the chiropractor like this last night. It's gnarly, it's cold out. I'm out of here, what do you gotta say? Bye. Bye, pound it. Let me get a hug. Oh, 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 oh. I love ya. Oh, the dog's on his. See you, Sparrow. See you, Roger. Let's get something from Rach. I love you. I'll see you guys later. Here we go. I think we're packed. Hope this is pretty good. I don't know. It should be pretty good. And I think we're packed, dude. I don't know. I always forget it. Unique New York, dude, this morning. But I, I always forget like I'm forgetting something. Or I always think I'm forgetting something. But uh, we're looking pretty good. Here we go. First step, Washington for the surprise mission, dude. It's going to be gnarly. I'm pretty stoked. Not sure if it's gonna go down or not because it's like kind of like a gray area So we'll see. Well, uh, let's do a cockpit check phone phone cord wallet inhaler And it's about two hours and 43 minutes to our first destination without a gas stop. Let's go Welcome to Maryland. Yeah, boys, welcome to Maryland. Woohoo! Washington, D.C., District of Columbia. We are gonna make a pit stop here to try and go to a recreational marijuana dispensary. If we pull it off, it will be my second time ever purchasing marijuana legally. So the situation here is they legalized marijuana in 2021 recreationally, but they don't fully have shops legal. So they have this weird like gray area apparently in the District of Columbia where you buy like a digital piece of art or something and then they gift you the weed. So like you're buying the weed, but you're not really. So I figured on my way to Florida, we have to check this situation out and uh, we're about 15 minutes out, so it's gonna be pretty pretty gnarly, dude. I'm a little nervous, to be honest. Really nervous. I'm starting to think about this, and I don't think I've ever been in the District of Columbia, and it's uh, it's like a different world here, dude. It's like, I don't know, it seems strange to me. Let's hopefully these dispensaries aren't as strange as it's feeling already, because it's a wild ride here. I just rolled up to the address. My bike's still on the truck, it's looking good. But I just rolled up to the address of this dispensary, and it's, uh, I don't even, I don't even know what's going on. We gotta check this out. What's going on, man? What? You have a man? Uh, no, do you need one? Can I get like a bandana out of my truck? Is that cool? I just don't, I forgot one. Yeah, can I get two of the, the Skittles? What's the purple again? Apple I'll get the gelato truffle. Here we are. Successful mission to the green room. Uh, I knew about the green room from a couple cryptologists that I know. Cryptologists are people that uh, study weed and know a lot about the culture. So let's see what we got here. We got gelato truffle. This was their premium. This was $50 for an eighth. So I got Skittles. Wow. And uh, Skittles. So I got a bunch of chronic. I'll say that the premium does look better than the, than the everyday stuff. And then this is something they gave me for free. So let's find a safe place and try some of this while we're allowed to smoke it legally in the District of Columbia and then get back on the road, boys. So shout out to the green room, District of Columbia. Actually, should I smell this shit? This is the gelato truffle. We're smelling it. 
and it says this strain gently seduced sedates the body turning even seasoned customers into lethargic cow's potato this strain's relaxing qualities make it ideal for abitating stress and insomnia okay mm. doesn't smell that great to be honest but we'll smoke it smell this they're claiming skittles is an indica dominant hybrid strain created through a cross of the deliciously powerful grape ape and grapefruit strains I'd say the skittles smells a lot better who knows we gotta smoke it to see boys the next leg of our journey will be 11 hours and 15 minutes dude bum town of the freaking dish of columbia there's dope nation one tent's collapsed Dude, it's gnarly. District of Columbia is gnarly. I didn't get any time to uh, try the product out yet. I just got stuck in a traffic jam already. Plus 21 minutes unless I do a little shoulder hopping. Here we are, finally found a nice little uh, rest stop to pull over and try this at. <clears throat> Get a little Kryptonic for the uh, ride. We're gonna try the, uh, the gelato truffle. Oh, wow. That is... Gang, 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 gang. Taylor Mabel. Well, the District of Columbia recreational marijuana is underwhelming, like, looks underwhelming, uh, smells underwhelming, but the potency <laughs> is over... Not overwhelming, but the potency is really good definitely makes you a little paranoid i'm driving a lot slower like it's definitely some a plus chronic there if you go top shelf so district of columbia ain't no joke you can go there give them your license or valid id proof of 21 go in pick from the menu whatever you want there's like there's probably 45 or 50 different buds on that menu walk out smoke it be big fucking ZD. all legal so now we're heading south Welcome to North Kakalaki, boys. Nation's most military friendly state. Like, I'm not gonna lie to the fans. Every time I see a cop or pass a cop or I'm driving behind a cop, like, there's one right up there. I'm tripping, dude. Like, I'm, I'm pretty bad bugged out right now, to be honest. Like, Tamale, baby. More traffic. I think this is uh, parking lot 95, not 95. Gnarly, dude. I'm only like, I still have eight and a half hours to go, dude. Oh my gosh, how this, the traffic today's been no joke, dude. It's like an intergalactic drive, intergalactic space travel. Fake nugget wrist watch made in 1988. We are at a rest stop somewhere in Rocky Mount, North Carolina. Figured I'd pull over and check the bike, which surprisingly looks perfect. I don't know how that's possible. We're killing it. A lot of salt on the road though. You can see it building up on the bike. That's pretty brutal. Yeah, we're gonna take a little uh, safety meeting, have a little safety meeting and get back on the road, dude. was a long push boys ah. so here's a futuristic problem with Tesla's they don't like to advertise check me out I'm about to get gas he's over there with his blinkers flashing because this area of the world definitely doesn't have electric start electric charging stations so I don't know what he's gonna do he should get a generator put some gas in it in the trunk start it and <laughs> and here we go we're off and mr. Tesla Still waiting for an outlet to warm up for him. What would a road trip be without at least stopping at south of the border just to see what's up, dude? You know what I mean? Oh, 
I've been coming to south of the border and stopping here for years and years and years. My parents always used to let us stop here and just burn off some steam, come run around, hang out. And uh, I mean, there's not much at south of the border. It's pretty much just riding into the ground, but you know, it's pretty cool. It's pretty legendary. Figured I'd get out, let my feet touch the holy ground. Whoa, stretch out a little. Get back on the road, I still got five and a half hours. So gnarly, dude. Stretch, good little safety break, and we're back on it, boys. Yeah, road dog in it, road motherfucking dog in it. I almost just got on 95 North, thank god I did it. Hey, Roger, it looks like we got a dead stop accident in front of us, like the road is shut down. Hey, no way, boys, no way. Welcome to Georgia, baby. Ladies and gentlemen, this is your captain speaking. I want to welcome you to Florida, uh, the sunny state. Uh, we'll be here for a couple days. So my GPS has me going down this dirt road and I don't see where this shit is, dude. This is crazy. Who knows where the fuck we are, dude. What? Ah! Uh, yeah. I lost a finger today, so I'll give you knuckles. What's going on? What happened? Uh, we were doing some things with the tractor, and my finger got stuck nice. in the hitch. Ripped the tip of the finger off. Nice. What's going on, guys? What's up, dude? I'm Hob. Nice to meet you. Are you coming from here? Like Maryland or whatever? I came Somewhere from... Somewhere up there, right? Pennsylvania. Pennsylvania. Yeah. On the blur, Dang. so. Okay, here we go, boys. Florida. It's, uh, gnarly. Let me just come over here and park my whip. So here we are. We arrived in Florida. I'm freaking beat. It's like 46 degrees. Bike's still on here. Land of thrash, baby. I'm gonna go in the cap. You guys know what it looks like in there. I don't know the situation yet. I don't know my heater. I don't know my covers. I don't know anything, but I'm going in there, going to bed. And I'll see you boys and girls in the morning. Right now I gotta keep a ton of vision. I need me 